All right, so today's video is gonna be an exciting video. I've been holding on to this for a while. Finally got a chance to do it, and we are going to do a test video on this guy. Now, Mira Safety actually sent me some of these before, and I did an initial video, but they only sent two, and uh, I didn't wanna like hurt them because uh, I wanted to keep them, because there was only two. But since then, a company called preparedbee.com actually reached out to me and asked if I'd be interested in doing a video with them. So I looked at some of the stuff they offered. They said, here's a couple of things we would be interested in sending you. One of them was one of these. So I was like, yes, I want one of those so I can finally do the test video and I'll still have my two to use. So they sent one of these out to the channel and we are going to test fire. Uh, as far as the plate goes, and like I said, we already did an initial video on this, but it's a 10 by 12 soft body armor plate made out of uh, UHMW PE. It's about an inch thick, but it's soft body armor, so it's a whole lot lighter than uh, regular hard body armor, which is really, really neat. Uh, and this is supposed to withstand a shot from a 30-06. Uh, I do not have a 30-06 but I do have this and I wanted to uh, test it out because I haven't shot it in a while. This is the old Marlin lever action and it shoots a 30-30. So this is what we are going to test fire on the plate. We're gonna take a couple of shots at it and see what happens. So let's check that out. Well, I broke my chain and I thought I missed it, but I did hit it and I barely nicked it. So let's see if we can hit right in the center. Let's see if I can set this up someplace now. Looks like I about hit it in the same place. Almost. Uh, it did go through. That is one heck of a cavity in there. It blew out the side there, it looks like. And I think that's what happened in here. I think it shot, and because I had messed up the back there, I think it went in and it bounced out the side there too, because I haven't found one of the rounds yet. But that is crazy. I mean, it did pretty much stop it. And I hit it, trying to hit it dead center, but 
crazy. Well, one of my test fires before the video started. I think I might have killed a lizard. I think I did. Sorry, little guy. All right, so it did stop it. Uh, one of the shots that did this, I was like right on the edge and it just kind of like tore it apart. And then when I shot here, I think it made it worse. And then down here, that cavity is massive. I don't know if you can see that, uh, but this thing stopped it. And like I said, it's rated for 30 aught six, which is a bigger round uh, well, a more powerful round than 3030, but uh, I mean, that's pretty impressive. I mean, I was fairly close to this guy with a 3030, and it stopped all the shots except for that one that hit up here and just kind of like ripped apart the side, which that was just where I hit it. But these two good hits on it, I mean, it stopped it, it did very well, and I am impressed. So big shout out to the repairedbee.com. Thank you for sending this out so I could do this really fun video. Uh, I do have other body armor that I've tested with rounds that shouldn't have gone through it and it didn't let anything through. It's just had a couple of dings on it. I thought about taking this 3030 out uh, and testing that because that hard body armor steel is only level three. This is level four. This is one of the best levels of body armor that you can get, especially civilians. Uh, so this was a fun little video. I might have another video with that level three play coming up in the future, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Be sure to get subscribed and get down in the comment section below. That's all I got for you guys today. I'll see you next time.